Hello peeps, welcome back to Empyrean Galactic Survival. Um, I'm just making some food and then I'm going to go to space for no other reason than I can. Um, last video, if you watched, you noticed we mostly be eating ham. Ham gives us loads of stamina, well a bit of stamina. Um, I'm still feeling a bit porky, so we're going to go for salami today instead. Five, six, seven, and one ham, because we like the ham. We could have steak if we wanted to, or ribs. We got all, look all it. Look at all this food. It's ridiculous. Look at this. <laughs> What's that? A pumpkin cookie, waffles. That's breakfast sorted. Ratatouille, pizza, burger, meat burger, as opposed to what? Fruit pie. Oh, emergency ration. That takes a lot of grub, doesn't it? Baked pumpkin. Yummy. Right, once our food's done, come on, Lenny there. Last bit. Then we can bugger off into space. Yes. What, what about that bit? Alright, one more sausage. If uh, that could get. Oh, wait! Get. Uh, another ham. What we like for food. We're nearly full anyway. I'm looking forward to this. The space is immense in this game. Let's put all that in there. Uh, I need a first aid kit. Do I need a first aid kit? I think I need a first aid kit. Sod the first aid kit. We'll be fine. He says. Hey, this is my house. It's very bland at the moment. I've completely had to restructure. Look, storage down there for all my storage needs. I don't know why it's his plant monster instead of storage. Oh well, never mind. There's my stuff. This advanced constructor. Usually when you build stuff, you have to put in every build, every individual component. But with this, say if you want to build something really complicated, I don't know, for instance. Um, let's go for a big gun. See that? You need to build two motors, advanced CPU, all that rubbish. With this advanced constructor, you just build that and it builds everything else for you in the bottom row down here. So you, that's it. It's easy peasy lemon squeezy. That's well good. I need more of the oxygen. Right, sod the first aid kits. I'm not bothering with them. Let's go to space. New ship as well, because my other ship got smashed to bits. Um, well, since I last made the video, I've had about five different houses and about the same amount of ships. And I've walked about a million miles. This thing is manoeuvrable to the point of absolutely ridiculous. Ah! So, let's hit space. You can see on the right the distance to orbit. Oh, that's Omicron. No, it's not. That's a lava planet. I'm absolutely loving this game. It is amazing. It can only get better as well. Still pre-alpha. Hitting space now. Oh, ah. Check it out. Dun, dun, dun. Right, I think this planet is Omicron. Straight ahead of us here. This is the other planet you can start on. There's an Omicron moon as well. Omicron might be on the other side of that. What else I like? Look at the difference in speed as well. Right, what I'm going to do, I'll put my helmet on before I get out of my ship. Um, I'm sure I turned you off. Look at that. You can whiz about in space to your heart's content using your little jetpack. Let's pump a bit more fuel in there. It's so easy to get lost in space though, to be fair. Check it out. I don't know if your ship gets blown up. If you can, <laughs> if you can reorbit, that's Aqua there. If you can like reorbit in just your spacesuit, I should imagine you might get a bit dead. So I apologise for the for the brick shape of my ship as well. I'm sure I turned you off. No, I didn't. Lucky that didn't run off then. Check it out, it's amazing. 
Should we go to this lava? Ah, asteroid belt. When you go to the asteroid belt, you need guns. I have been advised to sort of park a couple of kilometres away and walk in or fly in, like in my jetpack. Because you can mine off of here. This is where you get Sathium, Sathium. I don't know if we'll see the droids. Ah, there's one. Apparently you can take them out with the assault rifle. I come up here with two Gatling guns attached to my ship and they didn't even scratch it. I'm getting shot at as we speak. So I'm running away. I'm going to this lava planet. I've never been there. What's that? Let's look at it. There's more things flying around it. Look. should imagine I'm going to get a bit of aggro at this. I might be causing myself a bit of trouble here. But this it's got to be tested. There's some other games that are um, working on like the procedurally generated planet re-entry type thing. Bear in mind this is pre-alpha. I think they have got this nailed. And that was a bit ropey. Sometimes it's better than others. Probably not a great example. Jesus. It's actually quite eerie, this. Oh, copper. Don't want copper. Right, every planet has got its own, like, unique stuff. Look, down here on the bottom right, Zascosium, Magnesium, Promethium, Neodymium, Silicon, Copper, Cobalt, and Iron. I don't know what this is over here, but we're going to look at it. I think it's a drone. Whoa, I haven't... Oh, no, there's a drone right there. Bug out a bit. ship is awful to fly the um you get the escape pod when you first start and you can do that up and fly it that's very very manageable to fly it's pretty cool this thing flies like a bloody pig it's horrible more drones there's hundreds of drones on this planet this planet is poo oh, I could get out of here in a minute yeah off we go Whoa, 1.14 G gravity. Obviously, the more, the higher the G on the planet, the more power you're going to need. Look, that's pointed right at my planet as well. Happy with that. Here we go. Hey, Louis Space Drone. Go away. A good friend of mine has just built the Event Horizon out in space, like full size as well. It is utterly immense. I haven't even started. This is only the second time I've been into space. The first time I got dead. So, <laughs> I'm a bit reckless, I know. I should sort of, I don't know, not fly at, at plasma space drones. But you've got to have a look, in you? You've got to have a look. What's this? distance to Ning Ningues. This is a weird looking planet. Whoa, gravity's well low, happy with that. This is a weird looking planet. 
It's just cold as chips. We'll find somewhere where there's no drones knocking about and we'll have a look like what the unique thing on this planet is. This will do. Right. No, stop. <laughs> what are you doing? My ship's going crazy. Stop, ship. Stop. Okay, do your own thing. It's because my nose is up. There we go. Anyway. A restroom. Magnesium. Promethium. Neodymium. I haven't seen any of that neodymium on Acus. Acus. And. Silicon. I need silicon. Should we go and have a look? Ah! Promethium. Hopefully there'll be no droney things about. This game is immense. Absolutely immense. Right, this is the first time we've ever set down on this rock. Oh, <laughs> it's a bit ropey today. I don't know what's going on with the graphics. Look, what's happening? Whoa. Oh, get back in. Um. Ah! You rubbish, I'm going home. See what I mean by manoeuvrable though? Sod off. Yeah, we'll go home. <laughs> Shouldn't have any problem getting out of this atmosphere. I think I'm going to change back. I think this cockpit's a little bit too um, wibbly for my liking, actually. I like the combat screen as well. You can see on the radar there. That's pretty generic. So if you've played Space Sims before, you've probably seen that type of radar type affair anyway. I wonder, can I eat? In my ship. Can I? No. I can't. Oh, well, never mind. Let's go home. Have some ham. I like the ham. I think this is my home. Oh my god, that's mental. I think I'm going to be sick. We're nearly there, it's okay. Oh, we're in. What's that? That's a destroyed Talos back thing. Every time I go near them, I get dead. I get droned up to the max. Let's find my house. The map's a bit shifty still at the moment. Um, right, there's me old, <laughs> me old escape pod. There's nothing left of it. I ripped it in bits for parts. Still ain't got a bloody clue where I'm going. But it's okay because we're going there. I want to go home. Where's my home? Is that my home? What's that? This hover vessel? What? I don't own a hover vessel! Ah, I tried to make one earlier and it got dead with drones. Sun's coming up, beautiful. Am 
I even going the right way? I hope so. Yeah. Waypoints! We need waypoints! Or at least to be able to fly while you've got the map open. Loving the sun rises and the sun downness. It's pretty. Ah, I can see my pyramid. There it is. Why did I build a pyramid? Because I can! I might build a round... No, I can't build a round building. I might be able to, actually. I might put a big dome on the top. Another power station-y thing over there keeps sending drones my way. Bloody place. It's not a very friendly planet. right here well there you have it we've been to what the hell am I doing up there okay Let me <laughs> I don't understand am I still flying <laughs> Oh, isn't that interesting? Take me helmet off anyway. Yeah! Anyway, peeps, that is a brief insight into this game. Absolutely bloody fantastic so far. As you can see, there's still a, a fair few glitches in it, but bloody hell, it's good. Oh, made a dent in me runway there, look. Hope you enjoyed that. That was only a quick look. I mean, we didn't achieve nothing. I just thought I'd like show you about a bit because I'm nice like that. Thanks. If you enjoyed it, give us a like and a subscribe. See you later.